Cameron County may not be seeing the double digit mark at the polling locations at this point. However, they are getting over 4,000 voters come out to the polls each day and election officials say they are well on their way to make this the best election year yet. The first three days of early voting in Cameron County have each exceeded the 4,000 vote mark. Cameron County Elections Administrator Roger Ortiz says he expects the numbers to continue just as good or even better as Election Day gets closer. This year, he's hoping for at least 70,000 voters to make it to the polls. And despite the numbers, which seem to be on pace to hit that mark, they are no comparison to the numbers that Hidalgo County has set. They kicked off early voting Monday with a record-breaking 11,000 votes. It's the number of registered voters. Uh, the, the best way to compare counties is percentage-wise. Hidalgo County has got almost twice the, many, the number of the registered voters that we do. Uh, so it's, uh, you know, their numbers are going to be higher. Ortiz says there has been a more focused effort to get people to register to vote and then get them to the polls. He says Cameron County doesn't have the mobile voting units yet like Hidalgo County does, but he doesn't discard the possibility that they will in the future. Whenever I think Cameron County can afford one or we can get some grants or, or some monies from the state to, to help us uh, get some of a mobile unit, I think that's going to happen in Cameron County, but for, for this election we don't have one. Things have been going smoothly so far this election. Voters might have to wait in line for about 10 minutes to cast their votes at some locations. It's worth to wait, you know, 10 minutes is, is nothing to, to submit your vote and make your vote count. There are currently about 20 precincts open for early voting, which will continue through November 2nd. Reporting in Brownsville, Daisy Martinez, Action for News.